Hey Amazing Friends, my name is Alicia and we're back in the Tinkering Hub so I can show you a stop motion animation. Our setup that we have here is um, a stand using some pipes that we've cut, some PVC pipes, um, and attached to our pipe is this camera. It's a little video camera and connected to that is this cord that's going to connect to your USB on your laptop. The main things that you're going to need to get started is a stop animation program um, and the parts that go with stop animation. Now you can find those online. Ours is called Hue Animation, H-U-E. You can find all different kinds of programs that are available. You can find them for your phone, for your laptop. You don't have to make a stand like this. You, there's all kinds of ways that you can make a stand at home. The other things that we've made to go with our animation is uh, backdrops. So we have pictures um, of Amazium, places in Amazium, and then some other interesting pictures that we put on cardboard. Now you can use backdrops if you want. You can create your own um, or you don't have to use them. We also created little characters. We've got everything from Tinkering Hub Ray to robots to dinosaurs, all kinds of different things. You can also use Legos or clay. You can also do dry erase stop uh, animation. So basically what stop animation is, is the idea of taking a series of pictures, lots of pictures, and then um, our program will stitch the pictures together at the end and make a little video. So stop motion is exactly what it says. You have a side where you're going to create and then a side where your pictures will show up. First picture, let's have our little princess hop on the screen and what we're gonna do here is hit the space bar and that's gonna take a picture and send it over. And then we're gonna move it just a tiny bit and take another picture. And then we also have the option to delete pictures. So if you get your fingers in the frame or there's one you don't like, then you can always erase it. So again, move a little bit, picture, move a little bit, picture. You can do anywhere from 50 pictures to as many as you can get. The more pictures you have, the longer your little video will be. Our programs are set up to do 10 pictures per second. So what that means is for every 10 pictures that you take, that is one second of your movie. You can even do a background change. Um, and as you go along, you can create a story and create your own dialogue, your own narratives. And once you feel like you wanna see what it looks like or check it out, then you can stop, push play, and you'll see your movie in motion. It's a real fun way to be your own director and your own creator of an animation that maybe it's a story that you've had or a daydream that you've had before, maybe something you've read out of a book. Whatever you can imagine, you can make it happen with your stop motion animation. I hope you've enjoyed this little lesson. I can't wait to see y'all back here again. Have a great day.